Welcome back in Western Slope. Joining me right, right now to talk about the marvelous things happening in Montrose, Miss Tanya Maddox. How are you doing today? You know what? I'm feeling marvelous today because I'm in Montrose on a Monday. Can I Ma get in any more M words? I was about to say magnificent. I'm glad you're feeling that. Now, <laughs> Miss Tanya, let's just jump right in. And um, what does Montrose got planned this week? You know what? Not a gamer but guess what gaming is a big deal and if you are a teen or teenish from the ages of 12 to 18 uh, Montrose Regional Library has a, a teenish game night and it features Nintendo Switch games, um, board games. It's just, it's free. It's a good time for the kids to come out from 5 to 7 p.m. So that is Wednesday and guess what? There is pizza involved. Oh, man. Um, now, do I have to bring my ID to verify that I'm between 12 and 18? Because I'm a gamer and you got me right there. You know what, Demetrius, if you try to sneak in, I might sneak in with you. But no, yeah, you got to be 12 to 18. And I think they will figure out that you are, um, you know, you might be 19 or 20. Yes, ma'am. Just just barely, <laughs> just barely past the age threshold. But um, speaking of age, you guys got something for the older crowd pretty much a day or so right after, right? We, exactly a day after. And um, did I just hear you call me old? I will accept that. I'm okay with it. But it's called Beacon Fest, Demetrius. And it is Montrose and Delta's, um, you know, county. It's, it's the largest and most fun event for people who are just, you know, over the horizon uh, just a little bit. But there's live music. There is food. Don't laugh at me. <laughs> there are ed educational seminars. Um, it's all free. It is a good time. And I will tell you, these um, older people know how to party. Beacon Fest is a thing here. It's at the Pavilion. <laughs> and that is on uh, Thursday the 14th, starting at 9 a.m. Yes, ma'am. And uh, I like that word there, over the horizon. I'm going to have to steal that and add that to my vocabulary. Now, it starts at 9 p.m. Is it an all-day event, Miss Tanya, or how does it work? Yeah. No, it starts at 9 a.m. and um, it'll go into the afternoon. So you can get all of this stuff done before 4 p.m. Uh, because... You got to get ready for Kind and Dine on Saturday. That is a huge, 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 um, you know, nonprofit fundraiser that happens. And this year it's a speakeasy. So Kind and Dine's annual event um, is a speakeasy theme. They haven't um, told the location yet. Oh, I know. <laughs> But it is a 1920s theme party. Um, it is one of Peer Kindness's, um, in fact, I think it is their biggest fundraiser. People get dressed up, they go out, and it's going to be all snaps on Saturday. I was just about to say, that's a little bit too much. To, that's a too much fun on a Saturday. You got a 20s theme party, and then you got the speakeasy right there to go with it. Uh, Miss Tanya, how can, pe is it just a walk-up event, or how can people go to this? No, you um, order tickets, and if you go to the um, Peer Kindness uh, website, you can get tickets there, or just search um, Peer Kindness Kind and Dine, and they will get you all hooked up. I believe that um, this is usually a sellout crowd, so if you want tickets, you want to <laughs> you want to get them right away. Yes, ma'am. You heard it here first, Western Slope. You make sure you grab those tickets before they sell out on top of on top of the litany of things they got throughout this week to attend. Miss Tanya, as always, we want to thank you so much for letting us know everything that's happening in Montrose. Your time is greatly appreciated. Yes, <laughs> My yes, pleasure. yes. Speak on out of 